It's a new year. What will 2023 bring? Some people party at New Year and look forward with optimism. For others, it can be a wistful time of memories and anxiety about the future. There seems much we could be anxious about presently. We never know what news the next day will bring. And there rarely seems to be good news in the media. We long for news that is new, but it often seems depressingly the same. It probably dates me to recall a song called New Year's Day by the band U2. It was on their album War. Nothing changes on New Year's Day, went the lyrics. As conflicts continue around the world, as the climate crisis looms ever larger, as we are regularly reminded of the plight of the homeless and refugee, of those struggling to make ends meet in our own country, we may be tempted to fear that despite a constant flow of news in our digital world, nothing changes. The good news of God's love for us and for the world God has made, a love made visible in Jesus Christ, might be old news, but it's still good news. And as people and communities discover it, it is still new news because it's about the one who is both creator and recreator of the earth and heavens, and the one who can renew our own lives, so that in the words of a popular summary of the teachings of Mahatma Gandhi, we also become the change we want to see. So may I wish you a happy new year, one that is filled with more than optimism for ourselves and our world, as we look to the one in whose hands are time and eternity, the one who can and will make all things new.